In today's video, I'm gonna be reacting to the AP College Board situation. My TikTok comments have been lighting up about this particular subject and a lot of kids want to know what exactly is going on. For anybody who might not be aware, what's happened is the AP College Board has set up a fake Reddit thread and posted false information on there to, for lack of better words, to try to entrap kids into cheating on the exam. And if a kid were to post the false information that was posted on the Reddit thread, the AP governors would know that that happened and then flag that kid as a cheater and then obviously cancel their test and report any wrongdoing to their college admissions. There's really two main issues that I've been getting a lot of comments on. Number one, is this illegal? And my analysis is no, it's not. There's bad information out there that states that the college board has violated 18 USC 1038. However, this analysis doesn't apply for a lot of reasons, primarily because essentially all College Board has done is posted a fake or false study guide on the internet. There's nothing stopping a student from obtaining the correct information from their textbook or their sanctioned study guides. Additionally, the actions of the AP Board posting fake information online is not criminal. College Board is also a private entity and they're not a government actor. My last thought with respect to whether or not the actions of the AP College Board are illegal is this. This has nothing to do with a national security interest or anything criminal. From a broad overview perspective, this is just a deterrent to prevent cheating on an exam. And then this transitions us to the second topic. Is this entrapment? That is what a lot of people have been stating on TikTok. And the answer to that is no. Entrapment is a affirmative offense in criminal matters that someone can bring up when the government, the state, induces someone into committing a crime. This argument falls flat for the AP College Board scandal for a number of reasons. One, the AP College Board is not the government. They are a private entity. And two, cheating on the AP College Board exams is not necessarily a criminal offense. Now, getting caught cheating could have lasting effects on your life. For instance, the AP College Board has stated that they are going to turn over any cheaters that they catch to college admission boards, but that is not a criminal offense. So you cannot use the theory of entrapment for something like this. But it is important to note that a lawsuit has been filed in Illinois against the AP College Board for data theft. This lawsuit claims that the AP College Board takes users' data and sells it inappropriately to third-party websites. The AP College Board's defense, to my knowledge, is that the users consent to this. This is unrelated to the Reddit scandal, but it is interesting to keep an eye on. Okay, that's it. I'm sorry I couldn't fit this into a TikTok, but I hope everyone has a good day and they have a little bit better understanding of what's going on.